Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Oh my god, is he like a Christian rapper? Look, people ask me what the future is. All I know is I don't know who this is. Now they see me out. I have no idea who this is. Now they see me out. Uh, I don't know who it is. I don't but I've seen this like video. You don't like me, that makes two of us. Honestly, this normally isn't the music I listen to. I'm living life in the fast lane. Wake up every morning thinking I might have a bad day. Drive okay, he has bars. Park, then I go into my mind with an AK. Shoot every thought in my head, then it rotates. Losing it. This is pretty good. I like it. I bet for him, like, oh, he's like Eminem or some shit. For some reason, I get like this Eminem vibe from him. I just see a white rapper. I'm like, Eminem! Feels like I'm falling apart. Act like my image is It's catchy. Put on my guard. Even when talking to God. Sit in my room and I plot. Alright. I don't listen to a lot of rap music, but that is the kind that I listen to. There's nothing there that really has a pizzazz. It's forgettable. He reminded me of like a little more um, aggressive logic, because logic, you know, types more about like, you know, social issues. All these voices in my head. This one I've heard. Oh, oh, okay, I recognize him now. <gasps> yes, I've heard this song. It sounds super familiar. I have to have heard this song before. I Help him! This video is scary. Please don't come after me. I just wanna be alone right now. I don't really wanna take it all. Go ahead. Whoa. Is that like supposed to be his dad? And it's just like watching him suffer. I don't even want to go to your house. Every time I sit on that couch, I feel like you lecture me eventually. I bet that we could have made this work and probably would have figured things out. But so, I mm, now, but it's, cool it's deep. But oh, you want to be friends now? Okay, let's- Oh my gosh, if you listen to the lyrics, it's really sad. Must have missed that joke. Let me see if I can find a reaction. Nope, but at least you're happy. It's like one of my favorites from him. This hits with me on a personal level. Who hurt you? Like, what happened? I want to go hug my dad now. I really like when people like take rap and make art from it. It's like spoken word poetry. Yo, I don't know what it's like to be addicted to pills, but I do know what it's like to be a witness to kills. I've seen the video for this one and this one makes me so sad. Now relationship is something we will never have. When they put kids like that, imagine going through those things when you're a kid. I ain't gonna say that I forgive you because it hasn't happened. I thought that maybe I'd feel better as time passes. If you really cared for me the way you act then. Damn, that's deep. Why would you leave? How could you leave? Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Our last conversation, you and I sat in the living room talking about my music and I brought you something to listen to. What would we do without music? Honestly. A couple weeks later, guess you were singing a different tune. You took them pills for the last time, didn't you? It took you from us once, I guess it came. This is heavy. But if you're still watching, it's good because it's real. Holy crap. You should have been here. Oh my god. Bill's got you right. <laughs> oh, but he has a memory of his mom smiling, here. which is cute. I wish you were here. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what I would do if I lost my mom. So to watch this and then to know people that have gone through the same struggle, like it hurts. Somebody get the body bags. We're gonna put the beats in them now. Put the MCs in them. Season them. Put them on a beat. This is tight. This set's cool. Airplane. You rappers ain't hungry enough. You rappers ain't hungry enough. You rappers ain't hungry enough. I've been through hell in my life, though. But I know what heaven is. Father, forgive me for I am a sinner, but you gave me music as medicine. Oh, that was such a good. Oh my god. I like this song. Each song he has has a very deep story it, like in it. I'm like shaking. It hurts to listen to this. Not because it's bad, but because it's so real. It's like an older video of him. This is like probably some of his first shit, huh? He looks different in every video. <laughs> this is like a really different vibe. Oh my god. He has a good voice. I stand behind these words. I'm a Christian, but I'm not perfect. 
he like a Christian rapper? He's Christian? Listen, I'm just working. Yeah, it might take a minute to get it, but once you get it, everything will be crystal clear. Oh, check you out. I actually kind of really like this. I've seen it before. I've heard it before. They're all the same. It kind of sounds like a replica Eminem. Just kind of talking about previous kind of uh, uh, just sh that you battled with. That was so good. I hope they're really listening to what he's saying and really taking that in because these are some serious things that people go through and talk about and issues that we're having and he's like tackling them in a really great way. So this raw music video is from rapper NF. I've never heard of him, but I'm impressed by him. I've seen his videos on like the uh, recommended page on YouTube. He's one of the most requested artists we've seen from our fans in a while. Good. He needs, oh my god, he is so talented. But before we dive into some questions, we have some lyrics from two of his songs, All I Have and Real, for you to read and tell us what you think. Okay. What you're hearing now is me, whether I'm in front or behind the curtain. I stand behind these words here. I'm a Christian, but I'm not perfect. Oh, fire. Oh. My God, is he like a Christian rapper? If that's my calling or not, Father, maybe I should just not bother. Go back to that nine to five, but I'm not a quitter, so quit that. So I feel like he's kind of saying that he's been called to be like a rapper. Father, forgive me, for I am a sinner, but you gave me music as a medicine. Because you know I'm real with it. Don't care if you're feeling it. I'm feeling it. You don't like it? Then deal with it. And if God ain't real, real isn't. Wow! Religion is one of the most complicated emotional things ever because everybody feels it on a different level. It's so interesting to just hear him kind of like flow his emotions straight out of that place. So NF is signed to Capital Christian Music Group, an expressly Christian label, and he's considered by many to be a Christian rapper. Wow, I've never heard of that before. But he doesn't categorize himself as such, stating, if you're a Christian and you're a plumber, are you a Christian plumber? No, you're just, you're just your thing, yeah. There's too many labels for some reason. He just considers himself a rapper, that makes sense. As a Christian yourself, do lyrics like these or music like this make you connect more or would you rather not have religion used like this? I think that it makes me connect more to it just because it's so real. It's just like a part of the music and if you listen for it, you hear it. And if you don't want to hear it, just listen to the song. He's taking something that I wouldn't usually listen to, using something that I know that I can relate to, and then kind of making me appreciate it a little bit more. I kind of rather not have religion in the music, not necessarily because I'm offended by it. I have faith, but I'm not like super devoted. Like I like to you know, have my music separate. For someone who is not Christian, does this type of lyric or music turn you off to the artist or, or not make you connect as much? No, it, it doesn't matter to me. I'll continue to listen to it, whether if it has Christian lyrics or not. I could care less like what he, his background is. He just talking about cool stuff and like, I can relate to what his message is. I am not a religious man whatsoever, but I can appreciate the concept of people needing religion, and so I can appreciate the kind of perspective that he's bringing to the table from a religious viewpoint, even if it's not necessarily my viewpoint. Well, not only is his music charting in the Christian hip-hop market, it's also having a major impact on the mainstream hip-hop market with his latest album, Perception, taking the number one spot on the Billboard charts. What? That's so cool. That has to be like the first time that a Christian rapper has done that. Even though this dual success provides a wider reach, do you think playing to both a mainstream audience as well as a more niche Christian audience will help or hurt his career? Um, I think if you're a good enough musician, it should break all barriers. He's not like only saying, oh, this music is just for Christians or oh, this music is just for like the secular world, you know? It's like for everybody. The fact that he tries to not label himself Christian artist is probably gonna help him in the mainstream like with everybody else but the fact that he's Christian also is gonna pull in like the Christians who like that music. I don't think it'll necessarily affect the direction his career goes because he's not making music to be a Christian rapper and he's not making music to be a rapper he's just kind of making music to put out there so anybody that likes it regardless of why they're listening to it will listen to it. Well, recently NF has said, I've been doing this for a long time, so it's nice to know that some of this hard work has paid off. Honestly, it's motivated me to keep working, keep working hard, and keep moving. So after listening to some of his music today and learning more about him, what do you think the future holds for NF? I think that there are big things in store for him. He's just doing what he likes and making good quality music, not worrying about what everyone thinks about it. And I think that anytime someone just does what they want and doesn't really cater to like what the world needs, I think that he's gonna do great. He definitely has a message and he definitely has an audience which is fantastic um, I think if he continues going the way he's going um, sure he's gonna continue to see success he's not just some like run-of-the-mill artist he has like a really 
uniqueness to himself and it's something that a lot of people need to be exposed to. I'm super excited that he's on the show because I want nothing more than everybody to listen to him and get exposed to that and I, I would love for him to blow up. I think he's really good and he deserves it. Thanks for watching another episode of College Kids React. If you want to see more, then subscribe and hit the bell like Joni Linder and Cameron S. Have another favorite artist you want us to react to? Let us know in the comments. Hi guys, JC here, producer at FB. Thanks so much for watching this episode of College Kids React. Do you want to know how we put all these shows together? Make sure to follow us on all our social media. The links are down in the description below. Bye guys.